everyone, it's Ginny. I just wanted to show you today um, something that I've made for Anne Williamson. She's having a birthday giveaway challenge. I can never remember if it goes <laughs> challenge giveaway or giveaway challenge. Um, anyway, she's doing that and it's running at the moment and it's closes on the 30th of April so you've still got plenty of time to join in if you want to and um, she hasn't shown yet what she's actually going to be giving away so she's still deciding so it'd be a nice surprise I think so I'm entering her challenge and I'm sending her um, a couple of things so I'll just show you those and of course I won't um, I won't upload this video until after she's received it and shown it and everything. So, <clears throat> first of all, I've made a birthday card for her, um, which I haven't written in yet because I thought I'd show you first beforehand. I've just used some cardstock and I've painted it um, in colours that she said she likes, which are teal pink and violet. Now I don't have those specific paints so I mixed them up as best I could. So hopefully that's alright. I've put glitter on there. Um, she likes bling so I've put bling and I thought glitter was blingish. So so that's it. And on the inside I've just done some pattern paper, hearts, um, butterflies and some bling <clears throat> and then I've left the space there to write in so that's her birthday card <clears throat> excuse me my throat um, and here I've made a postcard Oops. and I made this um, using scraps that I have in a box on my desk I don't know if I've showed you this before but I keep a box and whenever I do a project and there are bits left over I put it in here and I've been gradually making postcards or index cards using up those scraps so this is what I've done the whole background is just like patchwork lots of different bits of paper and fabric and things made a flower out of um, printed paper that I made using a sheet of glass and my brayer. <coughs> the girl is one of those girls that I drew on an envelope just playing around probably while I was watching something on YouTube. Um, so I decided to colour her in and stick her on there and I got a, um, I don't know if it's a quote specifically but it says ask yourself what makes you come alive so that's that okay um, the other thing I'm going to give her is one of my previously painted postcards that I've done I did this last year I'm going to give her one of my <laughs> I can't remember what it was called paper towel flowers I've done a video on this a long time ago when I first started doing YouTube videos so that's just got a wire holding them together and some beads and I've got a couple of envelopes that I make out of my drop paper and I've put a few little extra goodies in there for her which I believe as a surprise and if you're interested in seeing you'll have to go watch her video <laughs> It's just things I've made, so there, that's it. That's my entry for Anne's birthday challenge, and um, I'm about to post that off, and I hope it doesn't take too long to get to her. So I hope you like that, Anne, and I hope everyone else, I hope you enjoyed seeing that. Just a quick show-and-tell type video. I will leave a link, unless I, I can't remember if I've said before, but I will leave a link to Anne's um, giveaway challenge video so you can hop over and um, if you don't know her you can check out her fabulous channel she does wonderful art 
She's a mixed media artist and she does some um, beautiful things. She does index cards and oh gosh, canvases and paintings and a whole lot of stuff. Tags. She's in a, um, I think, a monthly tag swap that she does. So really worth watching. She has a really great style and she's a fabulous teacher too, the way she takes you through what she's doing. And um, yeah, I love her. <laughs> okay, so that's it for this video. And um, see you again soon. Bye now.